Good morning. Breakfast, bacon. You got the same thing, right? Bacon, yeah. much bacon eggs, and pancakes. Bacon eggs and pancakes. Morning, and these pancakes—they are messing around here. <laughs> We've kind of uh, cut huge. out a slice from our pizza, which I don't is a think pancake. Both my hands barely cover. <laughs> so exhausted. Had the last night out at Fantasy Canyon. We started our drive here. Slept in that crazy place you already saw, and now made it through construction again, which seems to be our bane right now as more and more construction, single lanes, slow and stop, and people telling you you have to follow a pilot car. It's a nightmare. So we're gonna go. We're in an area that's near where my family lives, and instead of going down to Escalante tonight, Brendan and I just needed a rest. We had a comfortable home to stay in, but tonight we're gonna do a farm rural Milky Way. And we're gonna try and find some sprinklers and some of those Zomatic sprinklers that they have, those little long wheeled sprinklers that have run on a line. Those are really cool sprinklers they have on a farm that we could use for a, a foreground with a Milky Way above it. Just right there, I can see the Milky Way right now in this area. It is yeah. that low light pollution, it's awesome. fantastic. Yeah. So the key thing tonight is we just enjoyed ourselves a movie, hung out, and now we're just going out. We're going to be out for maybe 40 minutes. Cool. Maybe not even that long. Let's just get a Milky Way, guys. Day eight. Yes. That doesn't look like a farm like we were talking about. So he's up there scouting a location that we can do for capturing this temple. This is the Manti Temple and maybe get a Milky Way. We have no clouds in the sky. The light pollution off of that might not be too devastating and we can work through it and do two shots tonight. So we're taking advantage of it. Let's do it. I had to change my shoes into these Keens because it was wet. I had done a bunch of sprinklers on this grass and my favorite shoes, my little slippers, I can't get them wet. They're not really slippers. Guys are teasing me that they're slippers but they are just regular, regular um, sketchers. You know, laces, lace-free sketchers. Are we trespassing over up here? I thought we were gonna be lit up by that temple more. The light's so bright, I thought you guys would see us, but you're kind of seeing my face out of blackness. Oh, yeah, that's really... So Brennan's behind me giving you another shot, but nothing's working out with the scouting. We're looking up here, and the temple is getting further and further away from us, behind more and more trees. And then there's this big building right here, this ridiculous, it's like a maintenance like a, building or something. A maintenance building. Oh, these crazy bright lights. They got on. garage doors in the front. Yeah, it looks like a maintenance building that has all these lights to protect it from being thieved. But ha, ah, it's right underneath the core. We're hoping to put the core off to the left and the Milky Way on the left. I'm sorry, and then on the right the temple, but not from this angle at least. We're probably going to go over that way and try our luck. What did that turn into? That. <laughs> wait, focus. Oh, wait, there's nothing there. <laughs> wow. Wow. So, so that the Milky there Way. I mean, is I, that? Is this the tiny part of the Milky Way? <laughs> Maybe. It is. It looks like it, right? Yeah. That's not the tiny part. That's the core. That's the core. Yeah, the core's off to the right. So awesome-looking building. Really old. Definitely cool idea for us to try, but. The farm plan would have to be what we're going to do. We only have about 45 minutes to 50 minutes before the moon comes up. So let's go ahead and get back, find some farmland that's awesome, and get a Milky Way. Okay, so we went around the grounds of the Mantai Temple to see there's a couple of overflow parking lots that give us great options to roam around and really see uh, parallel back and forth in the trees and really see if there's a, an angle. And man, those lights were just so bright. They're, they were just as bright as the, the Payson Temple lights, even though they didn't look as bright. No, they looked like you expose half them. the light. And then there's a maintenance uh, warehouse, it and was. it was ridiculously bright. I mean, it was <laughs> blind, like shining right at us. Little Dennis. So we found the spot that's off of a road uh, between the temple and your parents' place, really. So yeah, um, that's kind of cool. 
and we he noticed this when he was out here. I was when? shooting Last some wildlife week. photography of eagles oh, in the, in the out springtime, here. right? Yeah, March. So we saw this cool triangle structure with the it's feeding the water to the big, huge sprinkler systems that go dragging way out into the fields. And so we thought, hey, this might be kind of cool. So we lined up the Milky Way with the triangle features and the silhouette. Yeah. We brought a light with us in case we wanted to light paint it, but there's a lot of detail and a lot of ugliness, I think, with the color scheme and the bright colors in that box kind and of stuff a like cold that. Cold metal and yeah, and so it looks way cooler as it's just a straight up silhouette. Like the Milky Way is so bright behind it that I think having a silhouette gives it a stronger composition. I think having that nice yeah. silhouette. You were totally right. When you came in, you kind of thought immediately that this would be cooler as a silhouette because of the shapes of all the triangles he was talking about. And as it curves around, it becomes this interesting foreground feature while giving away to all the light and color of the Milky Way and sky. So, yeah. awesome. I think it worked out. I'm we happy. We went two places tonight, and once again, the bright, bright light pollution one proved how difficult, <laughs> difficult it is. So, thanks for watching, guys. Thanks for following Photog Adventures. Hope you guys keep following the hashtag, the great Milky Way chase. Yeah. We are doing, this is night eight. Eight nights. Crazy. Tomorrow night will be in Escalante. We keep saying yeah. we'll be in Escalante, but tomorrow night we actually are in Escalante, and then that'll yeah. be night number nine, and I'll have a nice Brady Bunch picture of nine different Milky Ways nice. all throughout Orem. No, see, all throughout, all throughout Utah and Utah County, Salt Lake up at the Bonneville Salt Flats, and down at Escalante yeah. and Goblin. Oh, this it's been sweet. pretty epic. Yeah. Yeah, it has. So Whew. if you guys like and subscribe, we appreciate it. Thanks for following us, and come back tomorrow for more. We made it out to the Devil's Garden area.